everyone, welcome back. If you're new here to our channel, we are on the Greek Islands Tour with EF Ultimate Break. Um, today we will be ferrying from Santorini to Paros, and then a little tiny short ferry ride from Paros to Antiparos where we will have dinner, and then go back to Paros for the night and have a really chill day the next day and visit a town on Paros. Thank you for coming along and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy what you see. because of the wind and so today we are just staying at our hotel it's noon right now we had breakfast at like 10 and we kind of slept in we had breakfast and now we're just chilling and then we're about to go out to um, sit by the pool to sit in the sun and um, read our book and tonight we're going to the capital perils or like the biggest town and then we'll come back here and sleep and then I'm not sure how early we have to get up tomorrow morning to ferry to Mykonos. So, very, very cool experience. So far, Athens was our favorite. The history part of um, the ancient Greek history with the Acropolis and the Parthenon and the Acropolis Museum and the old legends, the gods, the history behind all that was really interesting um the islands are beautiful and super cool and a great experience but for us we like really find history fascinating and so i'm guessing if if we would have planned the tour like exactly how we would have done it would probably been spend more time in athens and like visit one island or like the closest island which would probably be mykonos and then go back to athens that, that would have probably like now that we've done it that would have been what we would have picked. 
So when we were packing, we went back and forth, back and forth. Do we take a check-in and all of the clothes that we would need for all of the 11 days? Or do we skip the check-in and only bring like seven or eight outfits and then do laundry? We ended up skipping the check-in and only um, bringing like eight outfits. But now we are regretting it because, um, well, okay, it was really nice to not have to look at checking around ferry to ferry to ferry and traveling and everything and deal with the possibility of it not arriving and all of that. But honestly, now that we're here, I think we would have preferred just lugging around a check-in and not worrying about, are we gonna get to do laundry? Are we gonna get to do laundry? Are we gonna spend two hours, three hours taxiing to a town to do laundry at a laundromat? Because some of these hotels, like the last hotel we asked, and they're like, no, because of COVID, yada, yada, we're not gonna um, do laundry here. So you have to go to the nearest town. You gotta get a $20 taxi to go and then do the laundry and pay for the laundry and then $20 taxi back. And sounds like a hassle. So this hotel said, yes, we can do the laundry, but we're actually, we have an agreement with a laundromat or whatever, and we send the laundry there. So it's $25 per small little load, little bag load. So we may easily made up two loads. So it was like 50 bucks to do the laundry. But that is worth it because we have to have it. One more video on our time in Greece and that will be Mykonos, the island of Mykonos and we had such a great time there. Um, yeah, so thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for the next video.